Hello beautiful people of the internet and welcome back to a new video. So I've been away for a while but I'm back making videos and I'm very excited about it. So as you can tell by the title of this video, this is a June favorites and I'm a little behind as it's already the 2nd of July. But I've got tons of products to talk about so let's go ahead and get started. So we will just start with some lip products that I've been loving. And this first one is the NYX Whip Lip and Cheek Color in Plush. And I have not tried this on my lip or on my cheeks, but I absolutely love this on my lips and it's such a beautiful color. So there's the swatch for that one. It's a very pretty color. I cannot get enough of um, colors like that. So this next one I got in my Ipsy bag. A lot of these products I did get in my Ipsy bag, by the way. Um, and this is the Mellow Matte Lipstick in Nude. And this one is... Um, more of a like mauve um, color and they both kind of have a scent it's not like really bad or overpowering um, that's the mellow lipstick um, I can't tell you why I've been loving colors like this lately but it's just what I've been reaching for um, and then this next product that I have is the liquid catsuit matte lipstick from wet and wild and it's cruelty free so that's a plus and i've really been enjoying the pink really hard color i love these kinds of colors on me personally and that's the one right there um i've had to apply a couple coats of this to notice uh to get it even but overall um this is really great and i'm gonna get some more colors to test out and try those um but i know obviously we have the matte lipstick this um dries down matte pretty quick the liquid cat suit and um, then the whipped lip and cheek color it takes a while for it to dry I find but once it does it sits beautifully none of these are drying on the lips um, and they don't make your lips feel crusty or you know gunky anything after um, you've reapplied several layers um, so the next product that I have is um, mascara and these I wear together and the first one's the Too Faced Better Than Sex and this is just my trial size that I've been trying to get through um, and I know a lot of people know about this mascara a lot of people love it so I'm not going to talk about this one too much um, but then I have Maybelline the Falsies push-up angel um, and this is the waterproof and I use this one for my bottom lash line I don't know if you can tell um, that bristles are just on one side and so it makes it great um, and it makes it easy to get down on the bottom lash line and to get those really nice um, okay, so I have some brushes, and I've got all of these in my Etsy bag. Um, this first one is the Crown Brush, um, and really I use this for my highlight. I'll just dip it in there and then use the edge that way. Um, it's really soft, and I've actually really enjoyed using this brush a lot. The next one is the Luxie 5 
14 blush brush and I love Lexi brushes they feel amazing they feel soft um, and you cannot go wrong with these and then the last uh, brush that I have to talk about is the SL Miss Glam L34 blending brush and it's just an eyeshadow brush to blend it out but like the other ones this is really soft it does a great job at blending everything out um, and I cannot stop using these brushes they're amazing um, I then have a concealer and this is the instant age rewind concealer from Maybelline and this is the one that um, twist and then the product comes out of this um, sponge up here and I use this for um, under my eyes as well as um, any acne spots or anything like that um, and it's one of the best concealers I've ever used Okay, this next product is the Goof Proof Brow Pencil by Benefit, and I use the shade 4, and what I love about this is, let's see, there's what it looks like, it's just a brow pencil, um, like I was saying, what I love about it is it has the spoolie on the other end, so it's a 2-in-1 thing. Um, and I know there's a lot, there's a dupe out there for this, um, I think it's for the Anastasia Brow Wiz. It's the NYX one, and I want to try that out, um, to see how they compare, and, um, any of these products that I'm talking about, if you know a dupe, or if there's just any products in general that you like, um, let me know down in the comments and I'll try to get my hands on those and try them out because I'm always looking for new uh, products to try out. Um, so let's see we've got a few more uh, makeup products but this is the 8 hour afterglow highlight from Urban Decay in Sin and this is like a champagne colored highlight it's absolutely beautiful on the skin um once I um finish up with this I'm going to um try to get a bigger size of it um okay I also have the um this face powder it's the Cody Airspun loose face powder and naturally neutral and you can get this at I know Walmart for like five or six bucks and it's absolutely amazing um, the one thing that I do not like about it though is the fact that it smells like something that your grandma would have in her bathroom or something like it just has a smell that um, I'm not too keen on but once you wear it throughout the day, the smell will kind of go away. And so then it doesn't bother you that much. Um, this last sort of makeup product that I have is the Sephora 8-Hour um, Mattifying Moisturizer Sunscreen. And this has SPF 20 in it. Um, so I've been looking for a good moisturizer and I came across this one. My sister was using it and the great thing that I love about this is it has a pump. I always love a product with a pump and so um, I'll put this under my makeup and it's really helped I've noticed um, with my skin um, it's not too dry after I will take my makeup off. Um, so these next products are some Zoella products. 
These next products are some Zoella products, and I've been watching her on YouTube for probably four years or so now. And this first product, I just wanted to show you the box of it. I've kept it because it was so beautiful. Is the Wonder Hand Moisturizing Hand Cream. That's just what the box looks like. Um, and then this is the actual hand cream. I love all of her packaging for this stuff. This next one is the um, from her new Sweet Inspirations line. And this is the Sugar Dip. It's um, bath salts. And like a, she has the cutest packaging I've ever seen. And so I'll probably keep this. Um, after I use all of the bath salts. Um, but they smell so good. And I know that they have recently launched here in the U.S. And you can get them online at Ulta. And so I'll link that. I'll link all of this down below. Um, and they have them in a few select American Eagle stores. And then if you live anywhere outside of the U.S., I know um, they have them at Superdrug and some other places like that. Um, so this next one I'm going to talk about was a recent purchase that I've been absolutely loving. And this is the uh, Diva Curl Wavy Mini Transformation Kit. And I have really curly hair and... Um, there's, the, it's just this side of my head that wants to stay straight for some reason. And so when I've used this, it's really been a game changer for my hair. And so within this, you get the shampoo, it's a low poo, a conditioner, and then a wave maker, which is just a styling cream. You can get a couple of uses out of this I would say probably four or five washes um and so this has been a lifesaver for my hair um the last product I have to show you is a recent purchase for myself and this is the Fitbit Blaze I had the Fitbit HR but it was just time to get a new one um, and I just bought the, um, black one. Um, so this is what it comes with. You can buy them in different colors. But, um, what I love about this is you can get, um, text messages and you can see your phone calls on your watch. There's workout programs already programmed into it, so, you know, if you're not sure, you're just now getting into working out or something, you can just go buy your Fitbit, and it tells you exactly what to do, how long to do it, it has a timer. Um, it also tracks your sleep and your heart rate. Um... And there's also um, the interchangeable bands. And so I bought this one, which is a um, really pretty, like it's a Tiffany blue color and with a coppery gold um, clasp. Um, and I honestly recommend if you have been looking for anything like this, the Fitbit Blaze is absolutely amazing. Um, so this next one is my favorite TV show. And recently I have been watching Riverdale. If you have not watched it on Netflix, I really recommend you do. Um, I've enjoyed it so much. I watched probably um, season one, which is the only season on there right now, in three or four days I think and so it's a it's about a uh, it's like a murder mystery in this really small town 
And so you kind of see the characters develop throughout the show and you really get attached to them and it really throws you for a loop. Um, and then I also have some favorite music. And so um, I have been loving Harry Styles' new album. Um, there's some really great songs on there. As well as I've really been getting back into listening to Foo Fighters more, uh, the Arctic Monkeys, and that type of music I've really been enjoying lately. Um, but that's all I've got for this video. So make sure you guys like this video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you are not already. And if you have any um, recommendations for shows or products you want me to try out, Link those or comment those down below. And all the products I talked about, I'll try to link those. And I will see you guys with a video next week. Bye.